Hey there, everyone. Thanks for joining us here on ClickOrlando.com. News 6 Plus and the Pinpoint Weather app. I'm meteorologist Samara Kokinas. Today was hot. We got up to 87, staying just a few degrees below the record of 90 for this time of year in Orlando. That's the heat record. But look at Leesburg. It got up to 88, tying the record that was set just last year. And it looks like uh, Daytona Beach and Sanford came within a degree or two of record heat today as well. Same thing for Melbourne. I mean, really, we're going to continue to see this heat trend last well into next week. Looking at fog tracker for tonight after about midnight, I think that's when we can see a little bit of patchy fog, but it really starts to build up around two o'clock and thereafter through at least six in the morning. And it'll actually continue through about eight before things finally clear out. Otherwise, I know that this particular model tries to hint at a few sprinkles of rain. I think it's overdoing it or overcompensating for the fog that we are expecting to develop. So for tomorrow morning, I think we're going to be dry and even overnight will be dry. Plenty of sunshine by the afternoon once those clouds break. And then as we head into Monday, another round of fog before the sunshine returns on Monday afternoon and the heat too. Your overnight lows, upper 50s to low 60s with patchy fog settling in after two, lingering through about eight o'clock in the morning. After that, we'll have plenty of sunshine with a high temperature of 87 degrees nearing our record heat once again. Let's get you some results and show you your pinpoint accurate seven day forecast. Heading into the start of the week, yep, more heat. We're going to be in the upper 80s, nearing 90 by Thursday and Friday, ahead of a weak cold front that could bring us a few sprinkles of rain. I think most areas remain dry with a high right around 80 degrees on Saturday afternoon. That's your pinpoint accurate forecast. Thanks for logging on. You're now up to date.